Hello, my friends, hello, and welcome once again to Stately Vaughn Manor. So today is time for the booktube spin number three, uh, which apparently was early, so I wasn't crazy. Uh, we did just have one of these, but that's okay. Uh, Rick McDonnell uh, made a little mistake and made his announcement a little early, but that's okay. We're going to do the booktube spin today. Now, I was going to do, this is Saturday, and I was going to do Sherlock Saturday today, uh, but I, I'm going to postpone that because I can't do this any later than I'm doing it because then I'll find out which number won the spin and it just won't be as fun. So I'm going to have to push off, unfortunately, Sherlock Saturday until next Saturday. Uh, I'm not just doing that because I ordered a Sherlock Holmes hat and it hasn't shown up yet. That would be ridiculous. No, I'm just doing it because of the booktube spin. And I don't want to have more than one video up a day. That seems excessive. I've done that before, but I think one video a day is, you know, that's about as much as you can take from me. I know. So, I want to thank everybody uh, for putting down their suggestions of books to read in the comments. Uh, I made a list of uh, from that comments. I... I it's only 20 though, and I got a lot more than 20, so I had to kind of whittle it down kind of randomly. So I've got a list of 20 here. Let's find out which book I'll be reading for the spin. I guess I got a while to read it. So let's see. Here's, here's Rick McDonnell here. Who's watching this video understands what we're doing here and how this works. We understand. Thanks. Let's find out. Good luck. Let's go. Uh, I'm nervous this time. I have some books that I really don't want to read, so I'm really nervous. And why are they on the list? Number two. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Rick. I, we appreciate that. Bye, Rick. Okay. Shut up. Shut up, Rick. Shut up, Rick. Okay. So it's number two. Let's find out what number two is on my list. I, I can't remember. Number two, two is a book called Crossroads by Laurel Hightower. So I have, no, I have no idea what that is. I can't remember. So Crossroads by Laurel Hightower. I'm going to get that book because I, I don't have that one. And I'm going to read that for the spin. So look for a review of that sometime within the next couple months sometime uh, within then. Uh, so that was the spin, but I also have an unboxing uh, to do because I did get some packages. And uh, you know, if you're on BookTube and you get packages in the mail, you have to open the packages on, on camera. Uh, it's a law. If you don't, the BookTube police, they'll come for you. We don't want that to happen. So I've got two packages. I'm pretty sure I know what they are. I think. So one of them, this was a pre-order, I think, or something. So this is an Amazonian package. Those Amazonians, they can't, they can't package anything correctly. So we'll, we'll see if there's anything left of whatever's in here. Let's find out. Okay, there is a book in here. And look, it's so well protected. What do I got? It's Conan. So this is the Conan uh, Epic Collection number two. You know, I do my uh, Epic Comic Book Wednesdays now uh, with Steve Donahue. So this is exciting. Um, I didn't really need this, uh, because I've got all these stories in the, uh, uh, second, no, the first Conan Omnibus, uh, and this is actually probably the teensy tiniest epic collection I've ever seen. How many pages is this? This is tiny. 262 pages. That's, uh, that's not much. That's not very epic. 
but that's okay. It's Conan. It's good stuff in here. What there is of it. So yeah, that's cool. That's package number one. You might be hearing me talk about this some point in the near future on a Wednesday. We will see. But I've also got this non-Amazonian package. Let's find out what's in here. This one's a little bit more of a mystery. Let's see here. Very exciting opening packages. Let's see here. Oh, this is, look at this. Individually wrapped. Look at that. Somebody, uh, somebody could teach Amazon a thing or two. Oh, this one has burst open. Let's find out. What... Okay, so this is for another reading project that I'm doing. The uh, Retro Necro, the Necroscope Retrospective. Uh, I'm going to be reading uh, the Necroscope series by Brian Lumley, uh, which I have on high authority, is a great vampire series. I did read uh, the first few books of this series, but it was a long time ago, and I remember them being kind of crazy. Uh, but they do have these fantastic, iconic covers. I'm just opening these at random, so what is this, number, number four? Yeah, look at that. Awesome. Yeah, Dead Speak Necroscope. So that's pretty cool. I remember these iconic covers from back in the day. Let's see what else I got in here. I think these are all the Retro Necro. Number three, The Source. I got the first one already. She seems happy. Look at that one. That one's cool. All right. Got a couple more in here. Uh, which one are you? What is this, five? Look at that. Dead Spawn. So, I'm all set for my retro necklace. One more, this has gotta be number two. I am assuming. Number two, Vam Vampire. It's a m misspelled vampire. Ma vampire. Yeah. It's a very unfortunate looking dog on the cover there. This person doesn't look like he's having a good time or she's having a good time. Or they. Whoever that is, is not having fun. This is a very 80s thing uh, for the classic uh, paperbacks <laughs> to do that. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna have fun with this series. I already know, I'm looking forward to it. So we're about at the end of the month here. So I will have, I'm not gonna be doing a wrap up video. I'm gonna kind of squeeze that into my uh, July plans video, which I'll do at some point. Uh, let's just say that this month has been a disaster reading wise. I had a week where I had an insane work schedule and didn't get as much reading done as I needed to. But well, but I'll talk about that. My dogs, they don't even care that I'm making a video. So I'm going to be ordering this book, Crossroads by Laurel Hightower. And that is my booktube spin result. Thank you, my friends for this random -y video uh, hanging out with me here. Uh, I, I anxiously look forward to seeing what you guys have ended up with on your booktube spins. And so I look forward to reading this, whatever it might be. So you guys have a great day today. I will catch you here tomorrow for the Sunday Penguin, a non-supernatural Sunday Penguin for a change. So I will catch you then here at Stately Vaughn Manor. Bye guys.